Hello friends, welcome back to Mercer class. In this video lecture, I will talk about uh, Jack Auto Gel 2%. So Jack Auto Gel 2% uh, contains a, a tofacitinib gel uh, and uh, how it is used, where it is prescribed and what is the price and everything I will let you know. Please do subscribe and share our videos. So it's a little bit of 10 gram uh, uh, gel which comes with the price of 1100 rupees. So which is very pricey. So now you need to know where it is used and uh, what are the conditions uh, where we can use it. So begin to begin with this Jack Auto is um, Tofacitinib is a Janus kinase inhibitor which reduces the inflammation. We do get a tablet form where we use for rheumatoid arthritis. But this is a gel we do use for three conditions that I'm going to mention over here and tell you about the problems. Now, the reason they use this Jack Auto gel is for atopic dermatitis. Second is alopecia areata or hair loss in males and then vitiligo so these are the three common causes where we use the um, this gel especially the atomic dermatitis is a condition you get a lot of images in the google also where you see that um, the there is a skin condition where there's a itchiness dryness and you know discomfort to the patients very irritable and uh, very vague symptoms you get in atopic dermatitis and there are several uh, what you call combinations or diseases with that uh, you do get with this okay and uh, one important point about this is that uh, the dermatitis especially atopic dermatitis you need to use different uh, what you call um, uh, moisturizers uh, good moisturizers along with that and you know uh, you should avoid frequent bathing uh, this is very important things you need to know and second is a law uh, hair loss hair loss where there is androgenic hair loss and especially seen in males uh, that will be very helpful and you need to apply night once and uh, or as advised by your uh, doctor and along with that as i said before is a moisturizer would be a great with this and uh, one more condition is uh, vitiligo you saw the picture at the end that uh, vitiligo vitiligo is very common and very you know um, shying uh, it gives a shyness to the pa patients for this uh, skin disease and Janus kinase inhibitor this uh, a molecule has shown 50% results with this so you can ask your dermatologist or a skin specialist for that whether to go ahead with that and uh, what are the results expected with this but as of now I know that it's only 50% with this but maybe in future with the different combinations or next level uh, gels we do get a good results okay along with that we do have a different treatment regimen for that uh, vitiligo where we use laser therapy also but still this is an a simple um, cream that can be used now uh, as i said how it can be used it is used once a night especially and uh, you need to uh, most of the time you need to apply the moisturizers and uh, you have to have a good skin uh, sun exposure that's also very important and good cotton clothes are very important no it should not be very tight also and the other thing is that what are the side effects side effects can be there can be irritation there can be inflammation then can be redness there can be itching and usually you don't see that that's why what you need to do is just apply a little bit over the skin for a leave it for 24 hours and then see if you are not allergic to this then you can continue um, and you can continue with the breastfeeding also there are no problems but ask your doctors for this and uh, the other important things is that um, if it doesn't subside maybe the diagnosis is wrong or it's not effective you need to go ahead with a further level of antibiotic or, or creams okay thank you so much do subscribe to our channel take care bye bye